Good evening, everybody. With uh, all the chaos of the last couple of years, to be perfectly honest, I kind of forgot that I had even created this channel. But one of my kids randomly picked me up a uh, blind, bag, blind bag toy, so I decided it was overdue for another video. So this is the Lego Disney Muppets minifigure blind pack. So without any further ado, let's just find out what we've got here. Of course there's no tear square. Okay, looks like we got Dr. Bunsen Honeydew. Usual basic Lego dude assemblage. Legs to torso. And the head. And Dr. Honeydew comes with a beaker. Obviously not his assistant beaker, but a liquid beaker, or I suppose uh, more properly a flask. A laboratory flask. Uh, looks like it's supposed to be holding some sort of pink liquid. And the usual four dot Lego display base. And of course the usual, like most line packages. Checklist with special instructions for the characters that come with something cooler than just something to stick in their hand. Looks like it's a uh, pretty cool grouping of characters. I think I would have been happy with pretty much anybody out of this set. But Dr. Honeydew is pretty cool. It does look like his legs are on the short side. So let's put him off the base side by side with a regular standard Lego dude using, ironically, another Disney-owned property, Marvel's Red Skull. You can see from there that the Red Skull is a little taller, that um, these are shorter legs than a standard figure, but they are still jointed. These are not the stiff legs that I've seen them use for some of the child and Yoda figures in some of the Star Wars stuff. So per usual there's your blind pack to standard Lego height comparison. Just the camera upward just a bit. Let's see, let's see how those two stand. And then our other usual standard one Warhammer 40,000 Firstborn Marine. So, about the same height, just a shade taller than a standard. Marine Battle Brother, even with the big funky sculpted head, he's still shorter than a standard Lego dude. 
Uh, it was a gift, so I'm not sure what the price point was on that one, but uh, that's a pretty neat little dude. Y'all have a good evening. Bye.